What is going on, baseball fans? Breaking news. Cody Bellinger has been non-tendered a contract by the Los Angeles Dodgers, now making him a free agent. So with that in mind, we're going to be looking at three potential landing spots for Cody Bellinger, the former MVP in the National League. So we begin with number three. Now, the third place on my list is that of the Texas Rangers. I think that for the Rangers, being able to bring in a high profile name like a Cody Bellinger could really bring some more fans out to the ballpark. I think there's an opportunity that he could go to a new location, a change of scenery and find a new way and a new approach of doing things. I think that with the removal of the shift, this is also going to be a player who could find some improvement in that area as well. So by bringing him into a place like the Texas Rangers brand new ballpark, being able to kind of build a team in around that stadium with some guys that he's going to be familiar with, like a guy like Corey Seager that he played with with the Dodgers. This is going to be a place where he could go and really have no pressure put on him and be able to try to just go out there, refine his swing in the game and put out a very good brand of baseball for Cody Bellinger. As we look at the second place on my list, it is that of the Colorado Rockies. Now, I think this is all about Cody going to a place where he could rebuild his offensive value. I think there's an opportunity for Cody to go out to Colorado, really find his swing again, hit at that high altitude at a consistent level for 81 games out of the season, and really be able to try to put himself in a position where he can get back onto the free agent market next season and really go forward and put together his best brand of baseball. Over the last several seasons, he has not been playing the same level of MVP caliber baseball we would see early on from him. So there's no doubt about it. He's gonna to wanna to be able to rebuild that value, find himself going to a contending team on a multi-year high paying value contract to be able to really solidify himself once again, as one of the best players in Major League Baseball. But the way to do that is you have to go out in this 2023 campaign and really show out. He's got a ball out, and what better way to do it as an offensive hitter than in the best offensive environment in Colorado. Now the number one place where I believe Cody Bellinger could potentially land now that he is a free agent is the Chicago Cubs. I think that there's already some rumblings about this online where the Cubs could be interested in bringing in a guy like Cody Bellinger. I think that there's not a lot of pressure on the Cubs right now. They're kind of all playing with house's money. And even though they're in a competitive division with the Cardinals and the Brewers, no one is really going to expect them to be able to be anything better than third place. So what better place to reestablish himself than a team that's already the underdog with the Chicago Cubs. I think there's going to be an opportunity for Bellinger to fit in with that Chicago Cubs lineup. I think there's going to be a competition for them in center field as it stands. But you bring in a guy like Cody Bellinger with some name notoriety, you have the ability and the versatility that he has to play really any one of the three, the three outfield spots for them as well as potentially playing some first base. We know that they like to be able to mix and match in Chicago. They are very analytically driven. And a guy like Cody Bellinger with some tweaks to his swing could really refine himself. You not only go into a better offensive environment, in my opinion, in Wrigley Field, especially if the wind is blowing out, than Dodger Stadium, but you also go to a bit more of a hitter-friendly division, in my opinion, when it comes to facing off against the likes of the Pirates and the Reds. So definitely a place where Cody Bellinger could end up. But I want to hear from you guys. Let me know, baseball fans, where is the most likely landing destination for Cody Bellinger? Is it the Cubs? Is it the Rockies? Is it the Rangers or someplace all together different? Let me know those thoughts down in the comments or find me over on Twitter at banter underscore baseball to keep the conversation rolling. As always, check out our partners down in the show notes below for lids as well as epidemic sound. And if you want to show us more support here on the baseball banter broadcast, you can do so by heading over to baseballbanterbroadcast.com. Use the promo code give thanks from now through Black Friday to be able to save 10% off your Christmas shopping needs for that baseball fan in your life. Keep it locked in all off season long as we continue to look at the latest news, notes, and my personal thoughts, theories, and opinions on the game of Major League Baseball. Peace.